Hello everyone, thanks for tuning in. This time around I'm going to talk to you guys about some of the things that I purchased during the lockdown. Um, well, in Malaysia it was not called lockdown. Movement control order and I bought quite a number of skincare products. The famous oatmeal, turmeric, mask and scrubs. It's like a two-in-one product. In a powder form and you mix it just a bit of water and you get scrub. And if you mix just a little bit more to create a paste, you can use it as a mouser. Sadly for me, I had to give that to my sister-in-law because um, I'm sensitive to the product. I had some allergic reactions after two applications. Because sometimes first application, it's quite normal for me to have you know, some reactions towards a new product. But after, I think it was after third application, yeah. Um, I still had the same effect so I thought it's definitely not for me. Just to be clear, I have eczema. My skin is a little sensitive. It may not be the same for you if your skin is completely normal. So just because I'm sensitive to it doesn't mean it's not going to work on you. It is a great product. A lot of people have tried them, tried it and, and it has shown great results. Do give it a try. Patch test first. If your skin really can't tolerate then you can just give it away. And then secondly, I bought this from another local brand, the Jelita KL. Um, this is also a mask. This is actually a clay mask. It's a mask, so you have to create a paste out of it and then put it on your face, let it dry for a bit and then rinse it off. Now, the products that have rose extracts, they tend to have perfume and because I have a sensitive skin, so I do not want to have perfume um, in any of my skincare products. Surprisingly, this is really, really good. Unlike um, the yellow, uh, the turmeric mask, this does not give me any allergy reactions. And yes, it does what it says. It me like that instant glow. I kind of like not make my skin dull. Just one of the things that I hope would improve is the packaging. Really, it's just a simple plastic um, uh, container. That's the only thing that I I think this could improve on but performance wise love this next I went on a haul um, on Watson um, I've always always wanted to try all this okay. one this is from uh, Hada Labo what I do is I apply this on my face on my dry face and then just kind of like massage it for over and then take a bit of water and create an emulsion and then I just massage it and kind of like try to rub it into my skin for a good 15 minutes this really does work I do get to get rid of you know a bit of white head and uh, black head as well to a certain extent and then I also bought this um, Avine, Avin, Avine I don't know how to pronounce it. Um, it's just something that I just want to replenish in my collection. Yeah, so far so good. I just love to have it with me, um, like um, at the office, at home, or sometimes when I'm traveling because you know you just want to put your face up in the middle of the day, you know, just to like keep it moisturized. So it's great for that. And then I went on Shopee and get these from Some by Me for a toner I really want a hydrating function and it has been great so far I'm loving it I use this for daytime and nighttime I do not have any um, breakout whatsoever from using this no rash no nothing by the way these things came from South Korea um, and it took about two weeks so it was pretty I was pretty impressed because I think it was it was locked down in South Korea, but they were still able to ship this to me. Right, so I got the Bye Bye Black Hate as well. So this is supposed to be like a cleanser that you use weekly, not daily. I just use this in my on my T-zone area. It's actually BHA foam that um, appears right after you uh, massage the product on your face. So you're going to wait until 2 minutes and then rinse it off. It works. Upon removing the foam physically, I could see like black impurities, you know, just tiny, tiny specks of impurities on the foam 
itself. Right, so I went on uh, Shopee again. This is also from a local brand. This is the Pastel Shop Skin Hugging Sleeping Mask. Okay. This is the last product that I use in my nighttime regime. But this is really, really good. And when I wake up in the morning, I immediately see glow. It's also free from sulfate, paraben, silicone, and alcohol. Next, next thing that I got from them is the carrot seed oil. Now I bought this because I want this to complement my retinol from the ink list. I use that in my, my nighttime regime. I think because it's from carrots, it's definitely got a bit of carotenoids. So I think this would complement the retinol because they are like from the same group. So what I do is I apply this after my moisturizer um, on areas that have you know um, puffiness and pigmentation. I think it's a bit too early for me to say it doesn't work. Or, I don't know, I, I can't really tell just yet. I think we'll have to finish this whole bottle to see if it really does help with skin lightening. Alright, so that's the end of the video. I hope to see you guys in my next video. If you have any comments or if you have anything you want um, to inquire, please do so in the comment section below. Take care and be safe. Bye!